Oh, good morning, everybody. <laughs> Welcome we are to live. The Daily Dose. I'm Jeff Collier. I'm Shelby Ledoux. And we are here with Sierra, the general manager of the Green Bay baseball team <laughs> from the Northwoods League, uh, live pretty much right past the pitcher's mound of Capitol Credit Union Park here in the village of Ashwaubenon. So, mm -hmm. Sierra, tell us a little bit about uh, the unveiling last night and uh, plans for Capital Credit Union Park. Yeah, the event last night was awesome. We had a live band, we had action stations with great food. Uh, we actually, you know, wanted to put together some of these smaller renderings for people to kind of see, you know, a virtual tour of the facility itself. Um, as you saw, we have a big uh, drape of everything in there. It's, it's super exciting to kind of see multi, you know, different views of everything. Well, yeah, and I mean, you know, a sort of multi-use facility also. Um, what you can kind of see here is a rendering for a baseball stadium. I'll, I'll get the camera a little closer in a bit, but yeah. um, it's for baseball, but this is designed for uh, soccer, um, for uh, concerts, for festivals, for other kind of community events as well. Yeah, we really want to be community focused. It's a multi-purpose facility. You know, we are so excited with kind of being the envelope with a lot of the new things that we're able to do at this facility. It's a beautiful park um, and we really can't thank Capital Credit Union enough for you know jumping on board and being able to see this vision and you know, help us. So to give some perspective where we're standing right now, where exactly are we going to be located if the field were here right now? So yeah, the pitcher's mound is a little bit ahead of us, okay. but we are actually like looking right behind our renderings to second, which is so cool. Um, the one thing that I think a lot of people, we were kind of talking about this before, but the outfield wall itself, dead center, is 350. Uh, so I think a lot of times people were like, wow, that looks super far back. But the rendering itself um, is definitely doing a great job in kind of, you know, showing uh, the facility and you know, the length of the... And then if you're looking on the screen, uh, on the left side, um, the uh, there looks like there's a slightly higher wall that almost actually people are kind of can't see it really on the screen, but it looks like people are kind of walking on it, but that wall is 19 feet, 19 inches for a reason. Yes, yes, of course, uh, Green Bay being next to a good, uh, our Packer community, uh, 1919, the year that they were um, founded here. So yeah, it's really fun. And what you probably, if you can zoom in a little bit, can't see, these are all shipping containers. So it's super cool and really innovative. Um, it's super um, exciting for all of us to kind of see the plans and mm -hmm. um, be able to look at this. But like I said, we were talking about the virtual tour. It's awesome. We went through and kind of saw the different ways. You're actually able to put these goggles on. Uh, and oh my gosh, walk, that's so cool. Yeah, and walk through the facility. So you're walking through the actual Capital Credit Union Park entrance and uh, going through everything. So it's, it's fun. So yeah. this is to really get a visual idea of what it's going to look like. When is construction going to happen? When is it going to be complete? Yeah, so construction itself is actually going to be complete around May 24th. And then, of course, you know, ready to have opening day in June 2019. Nice. And then uh, the other key part of this and that we mentioned uh, in the uh, video title is that there is a rename the Bullfrogs efforts going on. Yeah, so we are so excited to launch that right now. We love the, uh, you know, Green Bay name itself. So if people do want to come back and say, hey, we want you guys to stay the Green Bay Bullfrogs, we are completely open to that. But cool. what we want to do this year um, is definitely have the community involved. I don't think that that's something that they've done, you know, before in mm -hmm. making, uh, you know, a community effort. We love the village here. Ashwaubenon has been amazing to us. And what better way to get these really cool prizes? <laughs> I know you guys were yes. Yes. yes, tell us a little bit about if you propose a team name yes. and that gets chosen, what you get for doing Yeah, so you go to our website, www.greenbaybullfrogs.com, and you can enter your submission. Uh, when you enter your submission, there is then, of course, the grand prize. Um, you can win bleacher um, outings uh, there are also the big one which is <laughs> lifetime tickets here Wow! Uh, <laughs> you can get your own customized jersey hat and then you get to throw out the first pitch that is pretty awesome yes. you know I mean all for all for 
name in the team for you. Exactly. Team. I'm sure you're gonna get some interesting submissions. Yes. Uh, yes. When we ask uh, the internet to name anything, remember like Bodie McBoat face <laughs> for naming yeah. the boat. Baseball <laughs> so, McBaseball team. Or yeah, something. not that one. But you know, I wanted to invite our watchers right now to maybe share a comment below and maybe see how your uh, submission is received yep. online, at least on our site. Well, we have had two comments so far that I've seen. One of them suggested curds. As in oh, the Green Bay Curds. A big giant curd a man. <laughs> yes! Could you okay. Imagine right. a giant Curdy, cheese curd running Curdy around. Curdy running around yeah. the, the field. Like, I shooting. like it. Instead of like yes. the Brock Cannon, it could be the Curd Cannon. The oh curd my gosh. Cannon. Okay. Oh, we're oh, on to right. something here. We're, we're yeah. liking this. I'm, I'm getting like, hungry though. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> sounds great. And then somebody did say that they would prefer to see the name Stable Bull Frog. Okay. So there, right. there is going to be some back and forth. We are. Yeah, of course. I think one of the exciting things that we're looking forward to is just you know, the actual groundbreaking of everything. Um, it's all going to feel new and fresh and, you know, exciting. Nice. Yeah, it's really exciting. And so when do people have to get their nominations in or submit them at GreenBayBullfrogs.com? So yes, uh, our last day is August 31st. So please get your submissions in before that midnight. Um, and we will then follow up with our top names and open that up to voting again. I was just about yes. to ask if there is another vote then that uh, when the finalists are chosen mm -hmm. that we get to do that. So it is a process so needless to say you'll have your say no matter what whether it's you uh, actually putting in a name or just voting for one. And right. it, it already sounds like from the nominees and people nominating stuff that probably you will see bullfrogs on that finalist list. Over 200 submissions. Right. Just, just Over 200 already. submissions already so yeah. you better think on this and you better you better get clever because yes. Uh, it, it's not, uh, you know, yeah, baseball McBaseball team is not, not going <laughs> to no, work. I don't think so. I don't, I don't think it's going to so. work this time. <laughs> One can dream, right? <laughs> well, thank you so much for yes. being here for answering all of our questions. It's so exciting. We can't wait to see what this looks like when construction is all done. Make sure to like and share this video, and we will see you bright and early tomorrow morning. All right. Hey, have a good one.